Youth work promotes inclusion and participation. Therefore, we need to ensure these values and goals when designing and planning digital youth work. Digital youth work needs to address inequality and reduce the digital divide between young people by providing support and tools, particularly for young people who lack access, know-how, resources or interest in relation to new technologies. Some young people can face serious barriers to access technology and online connectivity. The use of digital technology and services requires infrastructure. We need to know and understand what devices young people use, whether they have access to the internet, how fast their internet connections are, and what kind of support is available. Our organisations may need to secure resources and provide young people with access to technology and the internet. The solutions may range from acquiring needed equipment, creating free internet access points, distributing refurbished or second-hand mobile devices, partnering with tech companies to ensure access to technology and connectivity, using low-tech solutions such as SMS to deliver information, counselling and learning services, for example. The next step is ensuring young people have the skills to use digital technologies. We need to be able to assess and know the level of digital literacy, experience and habits of online use. Digital youth work should start where young people are at and aim at advancing their digital competencies. We may need to offer additional training on digital skills when delivering youth work provision. In addition, an understanding of how media and technology works is vital in empowering young people to be active citizens and learners today. Technology never develops in an ethical or ideological vacuum. Human beings still run tech companies, developing and owning software, which must still be programmed by people. Whether conscious or unconscious, biases in society still exist and affect the outcomes when programming technology. We can encourage young people's curiosity into how technology is built and works. Media workshops, maker and coding activities are particularly powerful in showing the ins and outs of technology. In this way, we can also encourage young people to imagine how technology can support us in creating a more equal and just society. Young people increasingly spend their leisure time being connected online, formal education and work environments, continuously raising expectations for studying and working online. Young people may experience fatigue of being always connected and doing something online. We will need to find ways of reaching out and engaging young people in digital youth work activities. Our solution can be having young people as our partners in designing, planning, implementing and assessing digital youth work. How can we create a more inclusive and participatory digital youth work? Learn with and from young people about their digital skills and realities. Assess and address equality and accessibility individually and within groups. Design and create digital youth work opportunities together with young people.